Nothing happened. Nothing happened. I. You didn't see anything. Older. Nothing happened. Older technology is a weird thing. It's really fickle. You know, you gotta set up with like technology that that's this old. I, I can't. Anyway, technology is very fickle, especially at this age, you know. I mean, I'm working with, like, 30-plus-year-old equipment here. It's very, very, uh, very sensitive, older technology. Bert, no. Bert, yes! yes. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. Well, hello, nerds. Uh, it is Monday. Uh, I, thankfully, had the day off today. Um, and we bought a lot of groceries. So clean up the house. That was what we did. I did come in second in a Fortnite match today. That was good. Nice, Wistie. Nice. Plug in more potatoes to up the power. Yeah, something like that, yeah. Just like the entire, like, the floor. Hiltzy, I love you, but fuck you. God. Wow, Hiltzy. Wow. So, like, wow. the, the fucking, like, there's just gonna be a floor just full of potatoes with little wires all stuck in all of them. Just like a whole like potato circuit and all around the floor, all down the stairs, into the kitchen, and then one in the oven, because you know, you gotta bake a potato. Bernie, thanks for the lurk. Anyway, um, I'm playing more uh, Earthbound, and then on Friday I'm playing uh, The Elder Scrolls IV, Oblivion, the one with Sir Patrick Stewart in it, apparently. So. Oh, nice, Fritz. There you go. Fuck yeah, bud. Whatever gets the job done. Whatever gets the job done. Fritz, you understand. You're an IT. <laughs> Whatever equipment you can find lying around that gets the job done. All right, let's, uh, I don't know. Let's, you want to play some video games? Let's do it. Where's my video game? Yeah. Love me a video game. Oh, well, I hope everyone's doing well and had a good Monday. I'm going to continue doing some grinding tonight because I am not ready for this mall. This mall it keeps kicking my ass. Is this? Name, I, I, I know it's not for the times, but name a more American sentence right there. The mall is kicking my ass? Yeah. The things those kids have to deal with today honestly uh, only 90s oh. kids will remember so uh we had the tree guys come out today oh yeah how'd that go uh my tree is almost as naky as bowser fantastic there is so much debris because they they'll collect it tomorrow yeah so there's just so much debris on my on my lawn, like on my curb. Sounds about right, yeah. They they got it off off from over the house and they trimmed out a lot of the dead the dead branches and stuff and um given that we had about twice the debris that everyone else around us did when uh Ian farted on us oh, about yeah. many months back. Yeah, I remember that, yeah. Um Figured it was kind of needed, and with how much they took off, uh, yes, it needed it. Well, good. I'm glad that uh, that got taken care of. So that'll be that'll be set for a while. Yeah. We have like this small palm tree that, for some unknown reason, the previous owners had taken up. Like the standard shrubbery that is uh, along the sidewalks of the other units. Yay! Hilts is very happy for you and, and your tree. Um, but like the previous owner had like taken all that up and then put in this fucking jungle of shit. And one day I went out there like uh, I I just got in there and I took everything out. Uh, we had found a snake egg in there. A snake egg shell so like snakes had recently been living there i'm like well that's 
That's wonderful and safe. Would love to walk out of my front door one day and just get, you know, bitten by something. Um, so, cleaned all that out. But the only thing that I couldn't get out is this fairly well-rooted uh, palm tree that's out there. And every few weeks I go out there and I trim it back. And I can't... Oh, snake, snake, oh, it's a snake. Uh, and I keep swearing that I'm going to, like, call the, like, the the guys that do the lawn for the neighborhood and ask them how much it would cost to remove it. And then every Monday they get here, and I'm like, fuck, I forgot to ask them. And I keep meaning to go out there with, like, a hundred bucks and be like, listen, just take the tree, do whatever you want with it, and no, none of this ever happened. Here's a hundred bucks. Because I want that tree gone. Sure, that would go over well. Listen, I, I'm sure they don't give a fuck. hundred bucks is a hundred bucks. Oh my god, I can mount in here. You can mount in there? Mm-hmm. By the way, uh, Lolly is fully back on his bullshit. He is, uh, he is in fact playing the critically acclaimed MMORPG from Square Enix. As one does. I'm having lots of fun doing spoiler with spoiler right now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> Uh, let's see. What do I need? Oof. I need hella experience is what I need. Uh, I'm tempted to go in the mall and just, like, hang out on the first floor and deal with shit. Uh, Tom is... Yes. Uh, Tom will not be back for a little while. Um, he's... Yeah. Details are in the Discord. Uh, in the group therapy channel, but he, Tom is out. He's actually going to be here, uh, and by here I mean literally at our house, uh, starting tomorrow for the rest of the week. So, he's going to be getting, trying to get some much needed rest after the couple of weeks that he's had. coffee thing. The, uh, the espresso. Get over here, you package. Uh, of course it's that. There we go. There we go. But yeah, we're uh, we're thinking the good thoughts for our buddy Tom. He's uh, he's been through it this week. Oh, I don't like that. I like that even less now. I feel less concerned about that now.
Oh. Come on. Please. Jesus Christ. Come on, keep not hitting. Perfect, perfect. Okay, okay. Son of a bitch. There we go. Viv, Viv, it's not even 8 o'clock yet. And you already gotta do the thing. How much money do I have? Oh, I didn't have a lot. Nine money, bucks. Nice. Oh, for God's sake. from the hospital. Faffin, buddy, I can't think of anything more true. How you doing? Hope you're doing all right, fella. Fine, Viv. I'll get it. Oh, God. Oh, that was unlucky number 13, too. There it is. Okay, I have a question because I never watched DBZA. How often does that happen throughout the series? Someone saying Vegeta no and Vegeta saying Vegeta yes. It is a uncommon thing because it does not start happening until very late in the series. I see. And then they do it a lot. Fantastic. Listen, if you find more of those, I'll put them in rotation if you want. <laughs> yeah, Pernies, you know. Tom and I've been Tom's Tom's been doing just a lot of like you know just word vomit to me and you know. I'm like, listen, buddy, I wouldn't be much of a best friend if, uh, if I didn't listen to you, you know, talk it out. Oh, does it actually seek out and find me? Let's seek out new life and new civilizations. Da 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 Or something. Oh. Listen, Faffin, buddy. Don't... Don't look a gift mental health state in the mouth or something. Bernie, you're welcome to talk about whatever you want, friendo. I know this is this is something that you've you have some experience in, so and I'm sure, you know, as 
as anybody who's been through something like this can attest, it's just like anything else, everybody's experiences are different. So, just try to do the best that we can. I, yep, I agree, I agree. Oh, not that it's really gonna matter, but um, I am I'm out at three thirty tomorrow because my vet rescheduled my vet appointment. Oh, for Liara. Well, no, I... it's at three thirty, so I'm probably out at like three. Not that it's gonna matter, cause you know sprint review, but yeah. Ooh, ooh, I got a new attack power. This is probably going to cost me, like, fucking 28 points. Let's see. 40 points! Christ! This better be good. Started lecturing you. Your guts went down by 9. Fuck you, old man. You got a sprint review next Wednesday? Nice. <laughs> Oof, your guts. Yeah, Fritz, we do... We do two-week sprints at work. Uh, so... We're doing, uh... We go from Wednesday to Tuesday... To, like... Tuesday, a, you know... You know what I mean. Wednesday to Tuesday, every two weeks. So tomorrow is the last day of our sprint, and we do planning, start the new one on Wednesday, and then two weeks from tomorrow, we rinse and repeat. Totally scrapped. Burnt. It's not a dumb question. It's a, for someone who doesn't do what we do, it's a perfectly valid question. Um, so, we use a an agile-like system called Scrum. And the way Scrum works is, Scrum operates in iterations called sprints. The idea is, you basically, you figure out how much capacity your team has to do work, um, you take the work items that you have. Yes, Scrum Masters, yep. Scrum Masters are people that basically coach the team on, hey, here's how you do Scrum properly, and kind of set them on their way so that they do it, and then eventually the Scrum Master, you know, once the team is running things themselves, the Scrum Master rides off into the sunset. Uh, they don't actually ride off into the sunset. They actually stick around and try to help find ways for the team to adapt to any changes because shit's always fucking changing. But the point find is... Find new ways to be a parent. Yes, basically. Um, but yeah, so what uh, the way Scrum works is uh, you take your work um, and you break it up into bite-sized chunks um, that are like the smallest possible way to create value for whoever your, you know, your stakeholders are in it. Um, and then you do an estimation to say, hey, I think this, you know, based on how long it'll take, how complicated this is, all the things that we have to do to make this work, it'll take, you know, X number of points to do. Then you sit down and say, okay, we have five people on the team. This person can do, uh, you know, this many points. This person can do that many points. And then you say the team total is this, so... Uh, we plan for, you know, say like the, the team can do like 30 total points. Like, all right, and then you might want to reduce that capacity a little bit to build in time for things like meetings. 
uh, what we call ceremonies. Um, so things like the daily stand-up, um, the refinement sessions where you go through and estimate the work and figure out what all like goes into it, and things like that. Uh, then you plan the sprint. It's like, all right, based on you know this capacity, and then we have these work items. They're in you know based on priority order. Uh, then you go through and say, all right, here's the stuff that we're doing in this particular this this sprint, this iteration. And again, for us, uh, we do it in two-week sprints. Some places do one, some places do month-long sprints. It just depends on what your your team and your organization really decides on. That's that's kind of the point of Scrum, is letting the team figure out what works best for them. Uh, no, they don't get to wear a special hat, no. no. In fact, our Scrum Master, we specifically forbid him from wearing special hats. We gotta... You know, we don't we don't want him to get a big head about it. And the scrum master is the hooker, and I won't accept anything less. I mean, basically, yes. Tomorrow we're gonna go into work and call Julian a hooker, and I will. We will. We will laugh. Um, the yeah, hooker. Yeah, but without any context. Right. But yeah. So then you do the work at the end of the sprint, typically. You do a sprint review with the stakeholders to say, hey, here's the stuff that we did. Here were the goals that we set around this stuff. We met the goals or we didn't meet the goals. Here's why. And then here's, you know, show them the actual working stuff that we that we made. And then uh, once that's all done, it's like, okay, here's the stuff that we're gonna be working on. And bickety bam, you just work on it. Tony does a poor job in their sprints, even worse, explaining how it works to the SMEs who aren't involved with the dev. I kind of have this thing for, like, explaining and also documenting things, so... You know. But anyway, that's the long and short of it. A sprint is just a... It's it's a unit of time in which you do... You plan to do work. Also, hi, Matt. Oh, no, no, Faf. I'm gonna... We're gonna call him... We're gonna call him a hooker. <laughs> Not anymore, Mochi. Of course, Burnt. That's what I'm here for. Uh, I miss doing dev streams. I might do a dev stream one night. What so everybody's eyes, eyes can glaze over and watch me do, do nerd shit. And... <gasps> Liz, you made it. Hi, Liz. You can wear a cool hat like the fronts, but it's not... Well, that's... Okay, that's... That's fair, Faf. That's fair. It's a matter of policy. When we find it in the luggage, it's always the dildo, not in your... <laughs> God. Uh, that's true. It's not strictly necessary. Matt, buddy, you have had a you've had a long several months. I wouldn't worry about it. Didn't sleep enough last night. I saw that email. You bad motherfucker. Uh, listen, listen. All I'm saying. Where is it? A million points to Matt for passing that nasty ass exam. Fucking nailed it. Out of the house most of the day because they finally came to take care of the sewage back. Oof. Yeah, that that'll happen. It do be smelling like shit though. You never want another 24-hour practical again? Oh, buddy, that's... Yeah, that's hardcore. Am I familiar at all with rugby? Um... Honk, fuck off. <gasps> hey! I know that guy. That's Brian. Brian! Am I familiar at all with rugby? Uh, basically, I know it's... It's 
vaguely similar to American Hand Egg. But in, like, the lightest of terms. 19 hours. Oof. <laughs> Defeat of the ass exam complete, but only by one true champion. And that champion is Maticus Maximus. Was an actual shit just food? <laughs> I mean, it... <laughs> Listen, your landlord is correct to a point. It used to be food. Listen, Brian, I'm... I'm still getting my ass handed to me is what's happening. Oh, go feed the puppers. I'm doing that grind, buddy. I'm doing that grind. Get over here, old man. Staring at your soul. Oh, oh, they know what time it is. That hasn't been food for a while. Oh, no, absolutely not. That, that was, that hasn't been food for several not nows. I don't link arms and try to push each other around with the guys. Yes, yes, Faf, I, yes, I have seen that. That is also a scrum. Grumbled about today's youth, get the fuck out of here. Stagnant water with food. People are putting down the drain because the sewer pipes for the toilets are separate from the rest. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Uh, since fucking when. Hi, Memento. How you doing, bud? Since fucking when have the, the sink drain pipes and the sewage pipes been separate? Okay. Okay, pal. I assure you, my garbage disposal and my shitter end up in the same place. <laughs> Not around here, we'll see. like the snap person except they held up in the middle of that by the shirt. Need to hook the ball backwards with the scrum half who's basically oh yeah we don't we don't it's it's not different around here Hiltzy now they will separate it when it comes back so there will be water that is potable drinkable uh, and then there's water that is used specifically for things like irrigation that is very much not potable. And they will let they will they will tell you that you are not to drink the irrigation water. The hint guy. Hint guy, get out of here. Literally shop vac when I'm sure it was raw sewage. Wait, what the hell is this thing? 
It's... Okay. Lolly, do you see what this crazed sign says on it? And... Murder it. It <laughs> needs to die. This sign... Uh... This sign is attacking me from the void. <laughs> Brian's like, hello. <laughs> Brian's like, it me. M, M sign. I just saw the sign. That was crazy. <laughs> Brian, it's from Ohio. Let's be real. The scrum half rolls the egg into that mass, and the hooker on each team fight to hook it while the rest of the team does the reverse tug of war. The helmets are just taped ears. Helmets are hot. Protect the front's ears from getting ripped off as they bludgeon the other side. I love that there's... that's fantastic. That's fantastic, Brian. With a more than... we're more than corn. Oh. Okay, Liz. Liz, pal. I'm in I'm in the Ohio of the South. So I I understand this. Then again, being from born in Georgia didn't really help a whole lot either. Okay, but what if I was born in Ohio and now I'm in Florida? <laughs> that just means you, like many other Ohioans who have moved to Florida, are trying to take a rocket off of this planet. From San Francisco to, Atl <laughs> to Atlantic City, and also through the Ohio. From home to south home. Oh. The more than corn is why there aren't tourists. Yeah. Dogs don't want to eat their food, but if I open a can of corn and put some of the corn water on it. They do be liking that corn water, huh? And do be standing though. And do be standing though. Arise, my son. <laughs> Welcome back. You did it, Batsy. You did it, Batsy. I'm so proud of you. Hey, <laughs> I am the queen of bug snacks. Fantastic. Well done. You have bugged and snacked. That's right. Ohio does have a higher than average knack for getting famous, though. Well, that's... Liz, famous or infamous? <laughs> because that's an important distinction, I feel. Finished a mailbox quest and another one popped up. Oh my god. The snack conquered the snacks. Well done, Batsy. Very proud of you. <laughs> Both. <laughs> Brian's like, <laughs> am Ohioan can confirm both. I mean, again. God, I do not miss Ohio. Again, am in Florida, just Ohio of the South. <laughs> can you believe my parents wanted me to actually go back to Ohio after yeah, my Liz, uncle go ahead. passed away? That's. That's awful. I was like, no thank you. I'll stay in Pennsylvania. Yeah, yeah. Oh, we were in the arcade channel the other night, and Brad was hanging out, and he's like, he's like I, I live in the void. I'm like, fuck you. You live in Pennsylvania. Get out of here with that shit. It's like... <laughs> it's void adjacent at best. It's void with hills. Void like, that's with the hills. thing. At least... Pennsylvania has hills. List of people from Ohio. Oh God. Let's see. Came in here, gun snacks and blazing. Listen, you you were proud of your accomplishments as well. You should be. Good Lord, I love that. There's like 15 different like 
categories for s that's okay but then there's also criminals like charles manson that's fantastic uh and jeffrey dahmer well done ohio well done that that's why i uh i tend to push back on people when they give me shit for florida man and stuff like that because while i i fully embrace the florida man memes um florida man is in every state florida just has public records that's true that's very true and that is that's the that's the thing that people forget is that uh that florida man stories are only as as ubiquitous as they are because of our sunshine law which requires all of that shit to be public record stays quiet because she's from New Jersey. There are no fucking lock hearts on that list, that's true. You okay, Brian, like <laughs> But we also have Carmen Electra. I don't know if that's a defense, pal. Ohio has a lot of industrial rock artists as well. Mushroom head, nine inch nails, Marilyn Manson, etc. Significant number of astronauts as well. Tool. Yeah, yeah, that was the thing we were talking about, Momen though, is like <laughs> People will leave Ohio and move to Florida and jump on a rocket ship to leave this planet. Bonnie and Clyde actually ran their crime spree through your area of Ohio. Nice. I've noted that uh, the the amount of Ohioans down here, it it's borderline a stereotype at this point. It, I no, it is. It's it's. Eh. Is it Memento, or is it just Let's Ohio step down without? From floor? Is it? Is it's it just, just. Is it just Ohio without snow, bud? Okay, everything down here, no snow, and because there is no snow, the infrastructure is actually a bit developed. And, and, and this is the other important part that I've noticed, is that. Um, the things that would normally be about 45 minutes to an hour away because, you know, driving one city over is a giant highway separating your two cities. It's like 20 minutes at most. Like the... The it's just 20 minutes away meme is just barely a meme, honestly. That's 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 true. Thunder is roughly 20 minutes away from me. That that he's he's absolutely correct. I am roughly 20 minutes away from Lockhart. Yes. Charles Manson was from the I Cincinnati don't... area. It all makes sense now. <laughs> Florida is Spanish for South Ohio. Yes. People don't have to go inside due to cold at any point. Well, I mean, that's fair. But also, your crazy people don't get publicized as much because you don't have a law having to make it all public. Like, Bean has worked a couple of different, like, government jobs now. And she has to be extremely careful about the things that she puts in her email. Because literally anyone can walk in at any point and request those records. Anyone. Anyone can. They can go and request it anytime they want. Northeast Ohio and don't claim the south. Uh, there's a <laughs> the damn near Kentucky people. Kind of like, like in Pennsylvania, there's the Pennsylvanians. Yes. <laughs> the... I don't know, like, people that say they're from Cincinnati and shit like that, like, we're, we're not relatable to each other, like, at all. And, uh, hello, fellow Northeast Ohio in here, I don't, when people are from Cincinnati and we talk about things, like, we don't have a lot of common. We don't share the same Ohio woes for whatever reason, and it's very weird to me. <laughs> Viv, you are... Huh. 
Look at this guy over here. Look at you. Look at you, bud. <laughs> I feel like being in Cincinnati, you're just south enough to not have to deal with as much of the lake effect crap. So you moderately enjoy Ohio more than most other Ohioans. I say moderately, and I'm saying all of this loosely because I'm sure people still hate Ohio. But Jesus Christ, I hate it. Like the lake effect snow can just fuck right off. Yeah, Even every thinks about getting cold. It's just awful. Yeah, everyone has a FOIA process, but like in Florida, it's all basically published already. So the FOIA process in Florida is essentially Google it. <laughs> Cincinnati is like the south of the north. <laughs> That's weirdly that works. I don't know anybody from Michigan, but fun fact, I proposed in Michigan. To my wife. My wife. In the snow. And then I was like, hey, you want to move where there is no snow? And she was like, okay. True story, that's how it happened. Bean's family is all from Michigan originally. In fact, there's a, uh, there's a running joke to this day between Bean's mom and uh, Bean's aunt, her mom's older sister, about how they had to leave this dog behind because they had to move to Florida because of Bean's mom. I have eighty. Why they have to leave the dog behind? Was it a husky or something? I don't remember. I I just I think they just couldn't bring the dog with them for some reason. People that have huskies down here, I I don't. I don't know, man. That feels wrong. Yeah. Yeah, same. Love living where there's no sword. That's how you got to California. Yeah. I mean, like, that's that's why... That's that's how Lockhart ended up down here is... Because there's no snow here. I wanted to live where there was no snow so much that I just picked up... We just picked up and left. Like, I mean, like, we had a plan and stuff, but, like, I didn't come down here because of a job or anything like that. I wanted to live down here buddy my plan to move down here was i picked out i like i looked at the map and i pointed i'm like that looks good enough and i moved that's literally how i ended up here i know me too babe have all the snow yeah already you... lived in this area which is what picked the area for me but i always wanted to live down here yeah that, that no, was... snow is awful. Snow, the night, the night and day difference between just the stuff that you have in your life that you don't have to deal with anymore because snow doesn't exist. You don't have to shovel it. You don't have to clear off your car in the morning. Your car doesn't uh, rust nearly as fast. Um... You don't have to deal with infrastructure stucking all the time because uh, the snow and the ice and then the salt on the roads. Um, like, the hurricanes, okay, like what? Okay, but like, whatever. You get like, whatever. <laughs> you, you might get like one strong storm a year, two in a more rare year. Everything in here since the 80s, and especially the, like, the early to mid 90s, has been built specifically to spec for hurricanes. Um, so, like, hurricanes are not... They're not a huge deal here anymore. Because, like, everything is built so much to, to handle it all that, like, it's... there's There are a few places where it's it really is that big of a deal. Unfortunately, the Fort Myers area is one of those places where it wasn't as prepared and that was that's what happened to them last year we drive Subarus what is this plowing and shoveling oh Jesus 
Missed the hockey and that's about it, yeah. I mean, we have hockey down here. We we actually have hockey. We have a actually we have a really good hockey team down here. And they are those fans are legit. Nobody comes out for fucking sports ball down here like the hockey fans do. The Lightning, that's right. Yep. Like, Mochi, like, I, I, I like the snow. I just, I don't want to deal with the snow. We don't have the company to plow for. Cars will go right over it. Okay, but I own a Civic. Yeah, that's... Everything's flat down here. I don't have to go. I don't have to have an SUV just to go somewhere. Because of the snow. I like and going actually, places, my... Mochi. Plus, like... I forget that my car is almost 10 years old at this point. Well, yeah, it'll be 10 years old in two years? Because it's a 2014, so two years. It'll be 10 years old. God, my car's almost 10 years old. Jesus Christ. Old man hockey. Because it still feels like a new... The chat. Right? <laughs> Well, I, I mean, I drew, I stuff. drove a, I, I, I drove a, um, God, what was the Chevy Civic? Um, the Cavalier? Yeah, I had a Cavalier for most of my time in the snow until I got the PT Cruiser. Which honestly handled snow better than the stereotypes for it made you, would make you think. Yeah, snow Don't driving know why is a hundred percent. Did you know in in many states you have to, as part of your driving exam, you have to learn how to park on a hill properly, uh, or on a slope. And in Florida, you don't, because the oh, land yeah, is the so regular. flat here. <laughs> it was part of your it's written the... test, but not your practical. No, because where would they do it? Did you have to parallel park? Did you have to parallel park? Bean says she had to parallel park. Hmm. Oh, Liz, they're not even... I, we only see a gator in our yard like once every couple of months. I've only ever seen gators when I'm like walking past a lake and they're just, they're just kind of minding their own business. They're really not that big of a deal. Yeah, they... Like, as long as you don't get close to them and don't fuck with them, they're fine. I don't know if um, if other states driving nice tests have you do this, but we, we didn't have to parallel park. We had to do this thing called maneuverability, where we, like, have to navigate through these cones and then back through them to our starting position. Mm -hmm. And the, the back through them part is the same action as parallel parking, so that ends up being ends up counting for that, basically. Of course you do, Pern. Of course you do. I can, I can just see this, like, cartoon-esque, like, Pern getting bonked on the head by a cold lizard. Now, Liz, we, Liz, we only see them in our backyard because we live, like, on a retention pond. Like, a good-sized retention pond. Like, there's a retention pond that spans our entire street. And... That's why we get, uh, that's why we have a gator that shows up in our backyard occasionally. We get lizards all the time, and then I get frogs uh, whenever I turn on my bug zappers, or or my crackle beacon, as I've been calling it. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, and by mm -hmm. as I've been calling it, I mean I just thought of that. I, I love it. <laughs> that being said, my previous job had a warning sign on the walking trail that reminded you not to molest the gators. We have one around this the This is still Florida. <laughs> yep. You would keep him and name him Andrew. Of course you would. Of course you would, Pern. It's our neighborhood gator, that's right. Me 
Meanwhile, Hil Hilsey's over here talking about bow Zambos. <laughs> drive truck, you can drive Zambo. Drive truck, you can drive a bony. Boner. I like the cold, but also I spend 95% of my life indoors, so... That's mochi, honestly, not a bad idea. I always wanted a chameleon named Andrew. You get one, Pern. Why couldn't you? Could could you get one? Is that be the change option? you want to be in the world? Yeah, be the color changer you want to be in the you want to see in the world. Ice resurfacing machines. And bonies are very strict on their trademark, yeah. Jacuzzi's not so much. They've become they've become the the household name and they don't really care. Not that you know, you don't own one. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> hey, remember that time that you said you'd get bean a jacuzzi and you didn't? Oh my god. Mochi, I would love to come live by your volcano. I would love that so much. There was a couple of points in my life where I considered just up and moving out there. Shut the fuck up, Viv. God damn it, Matt! Don't you? Don't you? No. Nope. I did almost pick up and just move up there a couple of times, which would make sense considering that's where the mothership is, or Microsoft for those who, you know. Buddy, I'm getting she, hopped up on the queue. She is, she is, she is neat, Pern. What, Mochi? Come on. Tell me, tell me you don't know other people that, that call it the mothership. Ohio or Washington? Love Newfoundland, but it's a hard place to get make a go of it. God damn it. It's because everybody you know already works there. Damn it, Viv. Where people give so much that meant stored Nintendo. Yeah, that's also true. Yep. Listen, what is what is Nintendo but a little cubby hole inside of the Microsoft main campus in Redmond? Like, it literally is. If you go look on a map of that area, there's Microsoft everywhere, and then Nintendo of America is right there in the middle. Like, just right on the edge of the Microsoft campus. Matt, thanks for those five bits, buddy. I might change the font size on those alerts. Liz, I gotta tell you, some some of the most wonderful people the that I know. Is closing. A little. God damn it, Brian! Brian, thanks for the five bucks. Xbox says Nintendo wouldn't sell it to Microsoft. Well, that's. I mean, it is, it's in, it's much more incredibly involved than that, but yes. Yeah, it is, it, like... Three, pick number three, my lord. Oh, hey, speaking of, um... I informed Elena of my role as Donkey. Oh, did and you? And I made sure she understood the implications of that. Uh-huh. And she is happy to be the dragon. Uh, perfect. <sighs> Pernt, thank you for gifting a tier one sub to Hot Tub Beans. God damn it. Don't you love it when someone reminds chat that you haven't uh, bought Bean? A hot tub yet? Oh, for God's sake. 
You fucking people. So what you do is marry a rich Microsoft person. Mochi, how do you know that? And then tell Zunder your significant other works at Microsoft. Now Mochi, how how would you how would you know this? Oh, I cracked my I cracked my my chocolate orange earlier. I didn't even eat it. Oof. That's bad chocolate orange management, bud. I didn't even open it. I cracked it and then like I had to get ready for everything and then I forgot to actually eat a couple of slices of it. Oh. Here's the good stuff. Mm. Dark baby. Don't get me wrong, love milk chocolate, but dark, mmm. And this is one of the terries that they make with orange oil, not just the flavoring. No, Memento, I'm not. I've never worked there. Yeah, see, there you go, Fritz. Damn it, Hilti. Don't you shit on my hot chocolate. Or my dark chocolate, rather. Ew. Mm hmm. Oh, I have. I have chalky milk with the syrup and the Q in it. Oh. Oh, damn it. Yeah, don't. Ah. Listen, Matt, don't, don't, buddy, you're, we're not the same person. You're better than that. Dan was trying to be the rich Epic Games person. But Mochi, you would have to move you'd have to move to to, to North Carolina for that and There's an off grid cabin in the snow. Listen, Faf, I'm I, I Listen, that's and that's fine and all, but like But now you're talking about scenario where like you know that's like Picture perfect case scenario. Everyone has an office. That's true. Everyone does have an office there. But like, the the quote unquote super important people all operate out of North Carolina. Although Microsoft has a big office up there now too. Dan got a government job in his field. He moved to DC. Yeah, he might as well. Murderers live in both of those cabins. I didn't even see her. Damn it, old woman. Get out of here. I also don't want to live in a cabin. Yeah, well, I Lo like technology. Lolly likes technology and electricity and all that stuff. The Evil Dead with Gators. Listen. The Gators aren't bad. Does it have the good, uh, the good intranets? More importantly, I don't want to live in a cabin because my house isn't a cabin and I like my house. Acceptable internet, it's not amazing, but that's fair. That's fair. Yeah, Mochi, yeah. I live in a swamp. 
I like my private. I don't like my privacy. I'm. I stream on this godforsaken website four nights a week. My hubris. Hey, I know that guy. I know that guy. Hmm. Listen, I'm. I'm not. I'm not given. If I can help it, Faffin, I'm not given. Uh. Elon Musk money. I am, I'm not I will I will buy shitty satellite internet before I give him money. Like people want to enjoy those those parts of nature and stuff like that. They are more than welcome to do it. That ain't my thing. I live I, I like where I live and I like my home. I don't the, the pandemic has made me even less people-y than I used to be. Uh, the the pandemic has made me slightly less people-y, and I'm I I require people. Yeah, now glamping glamping I'm fine with. Glamping I'm fine with. Like the cabins at uh, at the at Disney World. I'm fine with that because I can just we can rent a golf cart and go around the corner to the buffet where they have all the the barbecue and fried chicken I can eat. <laughs> Duel of the fates, oh god. See, ah. The problem with that kind of stuff is that my Speed stuff's not there. Wolves. I like my stuff. I know I you stuff. like your stuff. You're 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 very much a hermit and that's a, and that's fine. Two mats enter, one mat leaves. Then the other mat leaves. Because stream is over. Wrote your name on a paper plate, pointing your party to your chosen force clearing. That's... <laughs> Mochi? No. No. Like, I believe you. But no. Yeah, I also need people. Hilti, you're one of like four extroverts here, bud. In this entire community. Circle the campers and build a big fire and play cards. Oh man. Yep. Uh, yep. I am. I am the. I am the designated service extrovert for a lot of people here. And I mean a lot. We're gonna try this and see how it goes. This guy came to my house, lifted an entire fucking cabinet, yeah. and then tried to fix my door just to be social. Listen, the, the, okay, the door doesn't shut, it doesn't latch correctly, okay? And it wasn't just about being social, I wanted the door to work. But also, fixing the door meant you get to be social for longer. Well, I liked it. I will- listen, I will come... I will come fix people's stuff. I like fixing stuff. Actually, no, Mochi, um... No, the door- part the door was there when I got there. It was- it- it happened afterward. After I had already moved the cabinet. It, it, it's actually the, um... My, my first date with Elena had a, a... A kind of thing like that. Part of us talking was that she mentioned her keyboard wasn't working. And I was like, well, I can take a look at it for you. And when we finally did decide to meet up, she brought it with her in hopes that 
Uh, I could either fix it or it would give her an excuse to reach out and try to talk to me again. It was very cute. No, okay, no, I didn't break the door so I could fix it. Okay, Lolly, Lolly, and Elena asked me to come over and help them move the cabinet because the cabinet that they got, this charging station, is the size of a full network rack. I'm not kidding. I need to put pictures of that now that it's all set up. Yeah, like it's it's literally like this fucking like seven foot tall cabinet. All right, fully assembled. Okay, and so. I get there and like I'm getting ready to leave and like somehow the subject of the door comes up and like I look at it and I'm like hey what's uh what's up and Lolly's like oh yeah that door doesn't shut right we've been I'm trying to fix it so I try to futz with it a little bit but it's it's a little too like off so it like the hole has to be redrilled Also, hi, Tay. How you doing, buddy? Sorry, I don't know. I don't think I said hi to you properly. Hidden. 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 I have a question for you. When do I get my... My... Uh, my... Who's he, what's he, my jig? My... My uh, save the date. When is when should I expect to see that? Lolly needs me. I can't get well. My save the date. That thing. Listen, I know words. I think it's already been firmly established that if he if he tries to quit his current job, I am I'm grabbing a hold of his leg and he's taking me to his new job with him. He doesn't really get an option in this, in, in this, uh, in this decision. I mean, that's fair. So March, okay, that's fair. That's fair. See, this is this is what I'm. Yeah, words are hard. Also, see in a minute, man. See, that's the thing, though, Faf. I like I need people. That's exactly why I started doing this. Like, like, all of this, just gesturing widely at, at the video feed, that's why I started this. It was because I needed human interaction. Like, I desperately needed it. It had been eight months since we had gotten sent home from work, and I required human interaction because I used to be in the office two to three days a week and I could just get up and talk to people and there were people and I could talk to them it was it was you know da da and what I given the option would I go back into the office absolutely not I would stay 100% remote but I still like need some kind of human interaction which is where this all came from uh, and, uh, why I go over to Lolly's house to help him move cabinets and get paid in petting the dog. I'm not kidding. Well, also Bob Evans, but mostly mm, petting the dog, Bob Evans. but mostly petting the dog. And you got food from the restaurant BJ's. I did. I did get food from, I did get BJ's while I was there. One time. Yes. Yeah. That was good. That's totally not going to be taken out of context at all. No, we not us never. Thanks, Hiltzy. I washed it this week at some point. I don't remember when. Oh, I'm getting a little faster. A little bit faster. A little bit faster. Yeah, exactly. See? Hiltzy, you get it. Oh, it's a couple of these.
Oh, damn it. Alright. Feed off emotional See. societal energy so COVID is empty. Yeah, yeah, yep. Yeah. No, you're not a social parasite, Tay. That just means, like, that makes you an extrovert. Like, if you, if you require absorbing the energy of others and, like, being around people gives you energy as opposed to drains, drains that energy from you, that makes you extroverted. If you're introverted... Like, and I think that's a common misconception, is introverts don't like, don't hate being around people. Like, there are plenty of introverts that like being around people, it just drains them. Like, it, it is it is exhausting. It is exhausting for them to be around people. Like, like Lockhart. Lockhart likes being around certain people. It's just like, after a, a while, it wears them down. You can be extroverted and still guarded. That's that's also true. That's also very true. Very reserved, but feeds off of people's energy. Yes. Yes. And a lot of times in, in unfamiliar situations, I get like that too. I will get like that where... Like, if I'm in an unfamiliar situation, I will sit back and like take stock and just absorb everything that's going on, but like I get so much life from just being there. You're more ambivert, you're fine being alone for a bit. And I think everybody needs alone time though, you know. It's just like, again, it's, it, it's really about like, in a general sense, do you absorb energy or do you expend energy by being around people? Found I that mean, basically, Hilti, yeah. I have found that I get irritable and cranky if I'm not if I if I don't have my me time. Yeah. If I'm not getting enough of that, I have found that I I tend to be a bit more of an ass. Aww. And not not just in the I'm an ass picking on Zunder kind of an ass, like an ass like fuck you, I'm an ass. Like, like an actual shit. And not just a turd. Like, you might actually tell me to fuck off if <laughs> kind of ass. I will say this, though. I have known Lolly for nearly three and a half years now, and I, I've never seen that side of him. So it's, you know, it's very rare that... I'm sure it's very rare that it happens. But... You very nearly did. Not, not anything you did, but boy howdy, the like month or however long it took me to get a sleep study and then get my CPAP. Oh, I remember that. That was... I basically didn't sleep that entire time. And I was a giant douchebag that for that run of time. Oh, uh, you do what you can. Well, I mean, I, I put on my work face. Because yeah. I had to. Yeah, exactly. Which is why you didn't see it. But, like, holy shit, I was an ass. You get, you get short with everyone about everything. Yeah. Yeah, Pert, that's... Yeah. Most of your close and for friends told you miss you so much during COVID. You don't just fool yourself and energies gather. Yeah, that and that's... Tay, I think that happens sometimes. Like, especially in... You know, like for me, being the designated service extrovert for... Several people. For so many people. Um, You know, that's... I think that's why I end up, like, basically collecting, uh, introverts, is because, like, I have that kind of energy, and I, like, I know what I need, but I also very much understand what the introverts need. And I, you know... <sighs> How do I put this? I can get my... Oh, Ness, Ness has 420 hit points. Nice. Uh, I can... <laughs> Jeff still has no PP. No, he doesn't. He doesn't get PP. Um, I, I can... 
Oh god, I'm I, I'm still trying to figure out how like to say this. Like, I absorb energy from being around my introverts, but I do it in such a way to where I try not to drain them from being around me. And Lolly, you you can attest to this better than I can because I you know you are an introvert. But, like, I, I, for example, there are some days where, like, you know, like, me and Lolly will just hang out in the Discord. Just hang out. And we may not say much. We, we may not say, like, th there may be, like, you know, a lot of times where we just, we don't really say hardly two words to each other. But, just being there like gets the required human interaction that he needs without draining him and also gives me the human interaction that I need so that I, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm not a lot, TM. I, not anymore I'm not. I used to be a lot. I am, I am not the person I was in my 20s. And, well, and there's also just in general, like, hi kitty. In introverts kind of just have so much to spend, right? And depending on who you are to that individual, you you have to you give expend more or less energy depending on the individual. Like I, me and Elena are 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 each other's people, so we don't have to spend a lot of energy to be around each other. Right, and that's so, like like Bean. Bean's the same way. Like, Bean is introverted, but, like, when she's around me, she gets all, all, she gets all antsy in her pansies. Mm. You do. You get all, like, you get all wibbly and stuff. You get, you get wild. Well, I know, that's, that's the point, is you're comfortable around me. You're, I'm your people. That's what Lockhart was just saying. Like, how Elena is his people. So, like, the two of them being around each other, it doesn't drain them. It actually helps because they are each other's people, even though they're introverted. Stop talking about in my pants. Get out. <laughs> don't, don't do that. Oh. Uh, I love you. Ah. Uh, yeah, I... Lolly bonked you. She's like, okay. <laughs> I don't know, Kitty. Who is your people? That's that's for that's for you to decide. Yeah. yeah I guess technically I should say the same thing because uh, I I was I got divorced in my twenties, so. That's also true. Clearly, I did something wrong. <laughs> hey, so did G. See, look at that. <laughs> Print, you could have a people. You just have to, you know, allow people to be your people. <laughs> right, Wisty? I know, a hidden. We love, we love a hidden. That nerd. Hi, Miss Secret. Where's that answer? Are you sure he talks a lot? Well, yeah, but it works. I want to be social, but I don't want to talk to anyone. That's what... That's... Yeah, I'm... I'm the one that talks to people. That's my job, is to talk to people. Hmm. Burnt, I'm your people, you dingbat. That's a loaf. Hi, baby. What's you doing? Are you being the loaf? Do you want a treat? Want a treat? A treat? Come on. You do. Oh, she's doing a little stretch stretch. You want a treat? Yeah. Come sit. Get him here. 
Come on. Uh, you know what I'm trying to do. Come here. You gotta see it. Good girl. Good job. Sorry, I'm giving loaf treats. Burnt, am I wrong? Oh, that's a good stand. Good job. Loaf, loaf does tricks for treats. Yeah. She give kisses for treats. She's not on the loaf cam, otherwise I would show. You sit. There you go. Good job. Good treats for loaf. Sweet. She's the best loaf. Ah. Uh. Nope, didn't want to do that. Don't care about the cup of coffee. Pert needs multiple service extroverts. Oh, I don't like that. Yeah, okay, that wasn't so bad. Please make you leave the house. Listen, I can't make you do anything. Every time he does, you're just like, you're not my supervisor. I mean, honestly. Pernt, make me do things. Also, Pernt, you can't make me do things. It's almost like I have some experience with people being brats. What? You wouldn't marry anybody like that. No, not at all. Ooh. Usually, you learn to wake up. Do stuff before people started clogging up the world. I mean, you know, everybody's got their their thing, man. And social services, the list of services. You know, of all the many services I provide, I should like keep a running list of those. Eh, you said fucking delights. Afternoon delight. Ooh. God, that one noise. Whatever that attack is, it sounds like a cat about to throw up. All right. Before it, like, the, 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 the. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's not inaccurate. No, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. All 
Alright, I think I'm getting there. This is just a whole bunch of grinding. Hi, Nova Pants. Nova Pants, I'm doing all the grindy grinds because I'm I'm in the mall. Those are Nova Pants, you see. Brought this mall. I'm I'm fucking this mall. Fuck this mall. Fuck this mall, and especially fuck the guitars that show up in this mall. We're so Just terrible. Get consent first. Stop that. And I have a hundred and four thousand dollars in the bank. Ooh, the ad that's currently playing on on your stream is Hot Hands. Is what? Hot Hands. What the hell are Hot Hands? There are these little packets that, like, you you rub them together, and they heat up. Oh. Like, whatever chemicals are inside of them, they start to heat up, and oh. then you can like hold them, and they start to uh, they start to heat up. I actually, when I was in high school, I would um, take them, and back when I was finally allowed to start wearing gloves while I was marching, I would take them and I would slip them inside my gloves so that. My palms wouldn't be so fucking frigid. Oh, I've I've had teddy bears. I just I don't want to go through the effort of like going to another town to get one right now, cause that's real far. You ever been real far? That's real far. I know, right, Nova? Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Not. Not only does Ness have uh, 420 HP, but Jeff got knocked down to 69 HP at some point. He did, it's true. I can't teleport. There's a teleport. Oh no. Has Zund Zunder, have you been making this unintentionally hard on yourself? No, I didn't know there's... Is there not... Is there a... Tele can I teleport? And Oh, okay, so Ness hasn't learned it yet. That's what it is. Okay. Yeah, no, Ness hasn't learned teleport yet. I was wondering what the, the next thing was going to be. Yeah, so no, I can't teleport yet. Oh. You're supposed to have it by now, and that would be indicative of the fact that you are probably might be very low level. Which would explain why you're getting your ass handed to you. I mean, maybe? No, you're fine, Nova. You're fine. <laughs> Main character in older RPG gets the ability to teleport the rest of his party around. What? Who'd have thunk it? What? I'm shocked. Wait, how am I? Uh, let's let's give Jeff a boost. I'm doing it anyway. Oh no! Oh no! Stop it! Stab it and... Oh yeah, no, for sure, Nova. I'm actually doing that to grind in the mall. Because, like, I feel like I'm a little under-leveled for where I am right now. Alright, Tay. Good luck getting the kiddo put to bed. Oh, also, I would like you all to know... That's a loaf. Loaf. Are you doing baffers? That's my loaf. She's the best loaf. That's my kidderino. She's the best. Liara's got to go to the vet tomorrow. Oh, poor Liara. She's got to get a vaccination. Yeah, loaf's got to get. Uh, she's got to get her her rabies here before too long again. 
I need to get the rabies because the animal license is due for renewal. Oh yeah, I gotta do that too. Fucking hate the animal license, man. Yep. Well, yeah. I, well, I know I don't. I know I don't have the Franklin badge. That's because the fucking because Paula had it and she got kidnapped. No hacks today, only mountains. Nice. The whole concept of an animal license in and of itself, I'm not necessarily against. It's the fact that they have no online portal for actually renewing the registration on said license. So I have to go there and I have to sit down, get exposed to COVID and potentially get skimmed because the last three times I've had to fucking do this, I've gotten I've ended up getting a new card because I've gotten skimmed every single fucking time. Hit him, hit him, hit him. And every time Oof. Every time I've asked, hey, you guys got that online website working yet? And they're like, oh, they're still working on it. And they're like, it's, I, that is, that is the job that I would get hired for. And then quit. Implement it and then quit. Yeah. Yeah. Don't even care. Ooh. RFID well no it's it's not that Liz it's like at the actual machine the machine's fucked yeah it's not that like someone's like pinging them and it's... I can't even prove that it's them it's just every single time shortly after that my account's been compromised in some way shape or form yeah oh I know Amy like that's honestly I thought about making that my career at one point is just going to different smaller cities and, and counties and implementing shit or ones that are just behind and doing that. Probably boilerplate that crap and the pro spin it up for him pretty quickly. Yeah, I could. The problem is they have to pay for it. Well, yeah. And so many of them don't want to, or don't think it's critical. It's like, do you realize how much money you are currently wasting on doing this shit in person? Like, you could have these people that are in this office doing, you know, less mundane tasks. Fewer mundane tasks. That's, that's also fucking true, Nova. That is absolutely fucking true. It's time to go to the hotel again. Like, okay, I'm... Ness is level 53, Jeff is level 46. Am I just grossly underleveled for being here? Like, I don't feel like I'm that underleveled, right? You have nowhere else you're supposed to be going right now? No, this is it. This is the only place that I can go right now. Like, I have to finish doing the mall, which I don't want to go up and do the boss. You know? Uh, this is, um... Uh, this is, this is four. This is town four. Four side? Is that what this is? Four side? Oh, this is Foresight. Okay, that explains why this music is so fucking familiar to me. Go on, then. Foresight's a stage in, in Melee. Mmm. And Ultimate now. Gotcha, gotcha. And here we go again.
Damn it. It's it's the emulator. All right. The emulator does this. RetroArch does this. I want to see if there's an update to RetroArch later because it hasn't been really doing this since the latest version update. Hmm. Yeah. Oh well. Oh whoa. Oh well. And the good news is I won't have to grind later. God, I hope not. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh how much I might be heavily over leveled? Seriously, for the way this mall is handing me my own ass? So then, is the mall just grossly like, oh, like is the mall like the mobs of the mall over level? <gasps> Spacey, 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 what are you doing? You were playing Cult of the Lamb. Hi, everybody. Let me get through this battle real quick, and I'll say hello properly. There we go. Hi everybody, I'm Zunder. And that's Loaf. She's the best kitty. Oh, can you say hi? Oh, she says, no, I'm sneeping. She's <laughs> sneeping. Hi, I'm Zunder, that's my cat, this is a TV, and I'm playing a video game. It's Earthbound. Uh, I just noticed it, oh, it crashed oh, by uh, the Discord overlay. Oh, it did, oh, damn it, it keeps doing that shit, hold on, let me fix this. Uh, she's the best loaf in the whole world, I love this kitten cat. Okay, let's fix that. And then, uh... Where's my... Now let me do this. First you do this. Then I do this. And then we do this. You all right there? No. Gonna make it? No, I am not gonna make it. Okay, this is this is being a big old poopy poop face. I wonder if I gotta reload. Let me reload Discord. BRB. Nobody tell Lolly that I reloaded Discord. No one tell him. Earthbound is a fairly unforgiving RPG. Yeah, I found that out. Well, Spacey, I hope that you had fun playing the, uh... Is it gonna work now? No one knows tap on. Oh my god, it's just, now it's just being crap. Alright, fine. Whatever, you know what, that's fine. Yeah, it's just... fine, no one needs to know I'm here. It's fine, no one, no one pay attention to Lolly. He's, he's not even here, man. Well, Spacey, I'm Fucking glad... Down. <laughs> Fucking gone. I'm glad that you had fun playing the Cult of the Lamb. Welcome in, Raiders. It is wonderful to see everyone. I am in the middle of recovering from technical difficulties, so we'll see how this goes. Let me see if the uh, the other thing works. Let's see if that actually works the way it's supposed to. Da, 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 da. There it is. There, I want to give the proper, you know. There, you get, and you get a second shout out, so. Fuck yeah. Ah. Uh, welcome in, everyone. Yeah, I am playing Earthbound, and I'm in the mall. And apparently, the mall is just designed to hand you your own ass.
Ow. Yeah, that's better. That's better. I like that better. Goddamn Mystic Record. Listen. Listen, Nova. Nova out here, well, actually. Nova's like, well, actually, it's not a mall, it's a department store. Uh, excuse me, ma'am, I think you called it a mall earlier. In fact, I'm pretty sure you said fuck this mall. I'm I'm fairly sure. I don't know. No, Liz, I'm good. I'll 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 keep fucking around and finding out, you know, as as I tend to do. Stop it. No. Not you. I refuse. I am firmly back at my bullshit, and there is nothing you could do to stop me. Boy, howdy, don't I know it. Uh, all right, I'm just gonna. You know what? We're we're doing it. We're we're going for it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Also, y'all might y'all may want to refresh. I know that the. Uh, Stream delay got a little weird for those of you who were here before the raid. Because of, you know, my machine just... Saying, no, I don't think I will. You would, Hiltzy. You would. Alright. I'm going to do one more stay in the hotel, and then I'm going to attempt to go to the top of the uh, the mall. We'll see what happens. Your face is good content, Hilti. Yeah, get wrecked. That's fair. Listen, I just, I don't know. We'll find out what happens, Liz. We'll see. I will say one of the nice things is, uh, and I'm sure they will update mobile at some point to do it as well, but the fact that, like, on desktop, you can now see, like, the backlog of, like, the last 50 messages from that stream in chat when you come in, it's just, it's so nice for getting, like, for getting context around shit and... Yeah, fuck you, guitar. Hey, uh, he's under. In case you were wondering, what? my mount can go no higher. God damn it, you and your mount. Hi, pup. Look at look at pup showing up. Yeah. Oh, there's 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 not much I can do about that, Liz. It's honestly like, um, OBS is behind now. There's not much I can do now. This is this is basically it. Oh, it goes. I'm, you know, you know, in the fucking mall dealing with shit. Hi, Ray. How you doing, buddy? Good to see you. All right, fuck it. We're going up here. Let's go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> roger, roger. Roger, roger. What do we got here? Is it another guitar? No, no, no. Yeah, fuck you. Love them guts. All right, let's go... 
Ooh, yeah, let's... Let's fucking go. Warrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Mm-hmm. That's the cost of doing business, assholes. If you want people to fucking do business with you and you want them to pay electronically, then you build that into the price of your services. Or fuck off. Don't offload that fee onto the customer. It's 2023. If you're going to do business with people, fucking learn how to do business with people. Mm-hmm. It's not a huge deal because, at least at the moment, for this particular instance, because by the time we have to deal with it again, it will be in many years. With the amount that they took off that tree, we should not need a pruning for a while. Still rude. The whole, like the whole yes. thing, it's just terrible business practice. Like, come on. Wholeheartedly agree. For us, it's annoying enough to be annoyed at it and know it's a problem, but it's like, at the same time, we're not going to have to deal with it for a long-ass time again with this particular task. Yeah. So hopefully they have it sorted by that point. Yeah, well, we'll see. The next area of attention is uh, our bedroom. We're going to be doing several things in there. Is where? Our bedroom. Oh, the bedroom, the bedroom. The printer's in there, and um, frankly, it has no reason to be in there. The only thing it's really doing is being a nice spot for my giant Eevee to hang out. <gasps> Go make trash can burgers for Q. Put put the put the trash can burgers on some trash bread. Love you, Nova. Love Nova. Where's my Nova button? I have a Nova button. Nova button. Nova button. You remember when Nova? I do remember when Nova. Those were good times. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Where's my hidden button? Uh, it's hidden. We can't show it to you. Yeah, I can't. I I can't find it. I don't know where it is. That's so weird. Oh, KFC. Oh, I want KFC. <gasps> Barnaby. Oh, Barnaby. He's such a good boy. He's such a big, fluffy, good boy. Oh, what a good boy. There's gonna be so much KFC over the next few weeks. By so much, I mean. Maybe next week. Let's see, this week, tomorrow, Liara gets her shots, and then I get a tooth and cleaning. Next week is my crown lengthening. Ooh. It's right there, Hiltzy. Yeah, like. Like, he'll see, you know, like when you search trash cans in this game and you can just find hamburgers in the trash. much better than KFC? Listen. We don't like KFC because it's good. We like KFC because we know what we're getting. 
It's not like great. It's good enough. AFC it, mashed potatoes are my tooth surgery comfort food. Oh my god, it's the photograph guy. How does one earn the right of shout out? I don't know, just kind of. It just kind of comes and goes, you know. They always forget something. Yeah, well, the Arby's does that. Thanks for the lurk, Wistie. They're soft. So they're a soft food, so they're they're good right when you've gotten a ground lengthening or something like that. Mm hmm. Or any other assorted dental work, you know, whatever it may be. All the fuzzy pickles. Every fuzzy pickles. This guy's in here. Oh, I love Arby's. Just wish they got the order right. Although, I think right now they've got the deal back where you can get two beef and cheddars for six bucks. Fucking love a beef and cheddar. Holy shit, I love beef and cheddar. Curly fries, get... Jamocha shake. Does that mean you can get beef and cheddars for less than eggs now? Yeah, probably. count of great value large white eggs is 674 for an 18 count mm -hmm. you guys get eggs must be nice right eggs in this economy so that is almost completely correct that you can get beef and cheddars for less than eggs yeah honestly yeah show again just for funsies because I paid for my ticket Bulbasaurus 40% done. Nice. I know somebody who would like to see a swole Bulbasaur 3D print. It may or may not be one one particular Matt Calder. I am just the same. What in the world is happening? Oh my god. Y'all need to settle the fuck down in here. Good beef and cheddar. Hey, listen, it's beef and cheddar adjacent. Maybe. I think this might be the game's version of... Yeah. F 
Fuck, man, I want... I want fucking... I want fucking... KFC now. Oh god, there's a guy on the stage. There's a guy on the stage. It's weird. PayPal says I got five bucks from Brian. Huh, wonder why. Huh. Hmm. What's my KFC order? Um. Usually, uh, three piece, dark, pref preferably two thighs and a leg. Um. I will do mashed potatoes and gravy and mac and cheese, or if I'm feeling it, coleslaw. Now, I might also get an extra side of coleslaw if I do like the other thing, where like I get the mac and cheese in the instead. I might get coleslaw and later make a slaw dog with the KFC coleslaw because the KFC coleslaw makes hella slaw dogs. Listen, you know, if it works, it fucking works. I listen, I'm I'm down for KFC for Christmas. Oh god, I want to go to Japan so bad. Mm, KFC the KFC corn's pretty good, pretty good. I'm not like huge on corn. I like corn. Slaw dog sounds like it should be a violation of our stream rules. Uh, listen, I fucking love slaw dogs. Oh, oh my. Oh my. <laughs> listen, okay, Matt, you remember what happened? You remember what happened a few weeks ago? Like, we got into this whole thing, and it turned out like this This happened on Stream Anniversary, where we ended up getting like, I don't know, like six people got fucking Wendy's that day. And ultimately, it was Brian and Matt Calder's fault. I was a victim of this event, yes. Yeah, you were. You were. Oh, Faf, don't get up. Don't get up. That's a trap. Actually, I don't need to... Uh, I don't need to stay. I'm at full, yeah. All the Baconators. Bean, if Bean gets anything from KFC, she likes the Famous Bowl, and we'll do that at home um, sometime. So we'll get like, we'll get chicken from somewhere else, or we'll get nuggets or something, and then we'll make our own Famous Bowl with like fucking instant mashed potatoes and corn and other stuff. It's yeah, it's fantastic. Talking about milkshakes and pie. Oh, I think that was hidden. Wasn't that like, wasn't that Friday? Bro, I literally just talked to you. Is it built in the game to where like two hours after you start the game, it, he fucking calls you and says like, hey, go do something else. And the amount of zero dollars. <laughs> you could be entitled to substantial compensation. Yes, that's and that's why I got the fucking baseball bat back. Yeah, hidden. It, it had to be like in the. I think it was like in the last week. It's it, like in the last week, week and a half. Your kitchen's been clean. Dishes wiped down and swept. Nice. Yeah, we did the, we did the kitchen today too. 
dishes. We did like the dishes, the sweeping and mopping downstairs. We did all that today. Bean made some blueberry muffins that uh, she says are very delicious. I haven't had one yet. But I'm gonna tomorrow. <laughs> Hidden's like, clean kitchen? Not even once. Blueberry muffins. That's right, Hiltzy. Hiltzy's coming over for muffins. Okay. Been away from you yet? I honestly, for the same. Here, have a, have a protein drink. Oh, yeah! I remember that guy. Money, money. Oh no, this is like the owl. Weekly Would you inspections. Like to hear it again? Oof. I'll tell you only once. This is the second time I will tell you only once. are they inspecting for? Yeah, that's that's that seems pretty excessive. Refuse to treat for chemically. Oh, imagine what in the hell? That is not your problem. Well, I mean, it is your problem because you know there's a roach problem, but that is not your problem. And if there's a roach problem and they're not refusing to handle it properly, there there's another thing you could be looking into because holy shit, that's that's nothing to fuck around with. Yeah, no, absolutely not. That's like trauma for me. 
<laughs> there is a portion of <laughs> of my life that has been deemed the roachening, so yeah, no thank you. Yeah, and now I'm in the upside down. I'm drunk and stuff like Ricky and Tr What in the absolute f The Dolly's Clock. Fantastic. I confront the abstract art. The abstract art stopped moving. <laughs> Ultra space. Moonside's haunted. <laughs> what? <laughs> Moonside's haunted. Jesus Christ. What? What? What the dog doing? What? And I cannot stress this enough. The fuck? Louie. Louie, happy Tuesday to you, bud. How are you now? I hope you're doing well. is this why is it so why is this surprise opening attack do it again 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 yeah get wrecked robo pump not bad not bad Why is this place? I mean, you know, Fritz, that's... You're not wrong. You're not wrong. Oh, yeah. Love that for me. Not well, have a stroke bad luck currently. Whoa, buddy. Buddy, that's, that's, that's not good, pal. I hope you I hope you feel better soon. I'm doing all right though. I'm doing all right. Can't fix certain problems because he's just a property manager. He's getting rich. That's what a property manager does. That's literally what the property manager does is manages the fucking property. This fucking guy.
probably never would have. Oh, buddy, I'm sorry. That sucks. Hey, remember when everybody said this game gets weirder? And I was like, oh, okay. Uh, they weren't wrong, were they? Boy, howdy. Toxin they know it isn't such a treating, so hopefully whatever it is, it's fixable and non-contagious. Buddy, I hope so. I I really hope so. Louis, you better get better soon, son. What Viv? God damn it, Viv. <laughs> Viv is just the best. Viv is a turd. Duck ass mother ducker. You missed it. Blunder died and you weren't here to rip him. Yeah, that's true. That was a, like a while back and Lolly had to do it for you because, you know, whatever. Yeah, yeah, Lolly got it. Viv's avoiding me. Ah, hanging out with people. Thanks, Viv. Thanks, pal. Thank you. 
Oh, Viv. Thanks, buddy. Yeah, I've been I've been checking every single day for that. What the hell's the night pendant? What the Jesus Christ is that? Ooh, yeah, let's go. Have a great charm. Ah, the noise. Yeah, there's the noise. What the fuck? Not the noise. Yeah, the noise. I gotta find my way back to the hotel. Sorry, Viv. It's that time, buddy. The Dark Moon Hotel, one sleep period. Yes. The Double Beam, okay. What the fuck? Okay. Um, well, that's, that's, yeah, that's that for the night. Uh, yeah, that's really fucking weird. All right, well, that's that then. And there's a, oh, just in time for a tiny flop. Oh, tiny oh. flop. Everybody say goodnight to the loaf. It's good night times for loaf. Oh, you say goodnight. Yeah. She's very sweet. She's a very sweet kitten. She's the best loaf in the whole world. Love that kitten cat. Oh. All right, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Uh, so I'm going to continue this on uh, Wednesday. We'll see how it goes, because now I'm in... Now I'm in the fucking upside down, I guess. I guess that's what I'm doing. So that's nice. Um, and then Friday, I'm playing... Uh, Elder Scrolls 4, Oblivion, the one with Sir Patrick Stewart. That's what Lolly keeps telling me. So. Uh, that's it, yeah. Okay, um, let's get out of here. Uh, let's go raid. Let's raid Coco, yeah? Yeah, let's go raid Coco. Hey, thank y'all for hanging out. Uh, alright. We're gonna raid Coco. Uh, hey, thank you all again for hanging out. I appreciate it. Um, I will see you on Wednesday for more Earthbound. Um, 
be good to yourselves, be good to each other, and uh, that's it. Yeah, I'm I'm out. Bye. <laughs>